We're here today to talk about one of the highlights from our day sale, Lynette Yedon Boakis, Kingfisher. When we first saw this painting, we were really excited. It's extremely striking, but I wanted to hear from you about why you particularly were drawn to it. The first thing that really draws you in is the gaze. It's the incredible serenity in the face of the figure, especially the sort of blues in the, in the eyes contrasted with the whites. The painting has just this incredible presence, but also this luminosity to it. There's something about Lynette Yadon Boachi's paintings that just command your absolute attention, and it's one of these examples, I think. One of the things that I find repeatedly so exciting and interesting with Lynette's portraiture is that you see these characters which are so extremely well rendered and these characters that she conjures feel so real. You imagine that it's somebody who she knows from her life or you actually almost yourself feel like you recognize them, but they're all fictional characters and they're taken from so many different references. And I think that ability to create such a strong personality, but just from a figment of the imagination, you know, with no preparatory sketches, with no long planning, I find that really impressive this sort of feathered ruff, to me also makes a really strong art historical reference. Of kind of old portraiture where you expect these kind of ruffled, duke-like characters. But you know, the paintings of, of Digger, of Sickert, where you have that detail and a very kind of strong canon of portraiture. So I see not only is there a reference to other paintings that she's painted, but you also see references to old master painting. In the old masters, you have all of these beautiful feathers that were added yeah. onto hats, onto, onto garments, and it's quite interesting because, of course, Kingfisher is a bird, but I don't think the title really means to explain the work. I think her titles are ju just really another brushstroke. Animals hold a very important place in her poetry. Of course, Lynette Yadon Boas, she's also a writer. And here, even though it's not really the, the whole bird, it's just the feathers, again, the presence can be felt. So with all the amazing references and, and everything that this painting holds within it, I think I certainly feel that this is probably the strongest small-scale painting by Lynette that I've seen. I mean, would you agree? Absolutely. I think it's a painting you cannot miss.